a beard now. So he's got that dark beard going underneath. And uh, he's up against Shahin Karamanov of Azerbaijan. This is in the under 90 kilo category. You're always caught there. Why not? Corner judge says no, he must have landed on his front then. Yuko to Nabali, beginning to warm up here. Oh, Nabali <laughs> couldn't quite bring it off. Not the big one anyway. Vasari is on the board. So he's got a good lead now with 2.43 left on the clock. Karamanov coming back there strongly with that Uchimata attempt. Nabali, the Kawuchi, and then almost getting caught. Could have countered him there, but there wasn't enough power.
Oh, good effort with the Uchimata. Couldn't quite bring it off. Yeah, this is a good idea from Frank Hochko to call them together. I, I didn't think it was Wazari. They're going to give him Wazari, but uh, I. That was good. That was good. That was really good because I think the referee and commission wanted to give Wazari, but Ochko didn't agree with any score, nor did Hempel in the corner. Only um, the, the corner judge on one side uh, agreed with the score, which he said was Wazari. So they, the mad officials said, no, we're going to give a Yuko. That, that, that was really good. That was really good. David Karbelashvili from Georgia and Evgeny Katayev from Ukraine. Let's be ready for fight at the Met One. Beore Katamze Sachi Dot Moimza Devian, David Alarza Espaneti, Roman Gotiuki Ukraina. David Alarza from Spain and Roman Gontiuk from Ukraine. Please be ready for fight at the match two. Well, Gomanov has been given every chance here because um, there was a point at which he was going to go out with the Wazari Awazeti upon, but uh, the referee saved him. In any case, Kabali Kijun Nabali is the winner. He goes into the next round. Stay with us for live action from the Tbilisi World Cup. Ukraine.